In the last few years, Microsoft's AI-assisted mapping project has released sets of building footprint data for different parts of the world, including the United States. If you want to get this data, you can go to where it's stored and you can download it. The problem you might have if you're a desktop GIS user is the format. The format is a rather cumbersome GeoJSON. So if you're looking to get in a format that works more easily with something like QGIS, you can head to the resources page on my website where I have a separate download page for all this data. And it's done on a state-by-state -state basis and they're all geo packages. So let's try one of the larger states just to show you how quick this can be loading it into a computer. So let's try Illinois. I'll click on the download and I'll pause while it's downloading. The download was 500 megabytes and when I unzip it, it's about 1.3 gigabytes. So it's quite a large file for all the buildings in Illinois. But let me just drag and drop it into QGIS and I'll minimize that window. And on my computer, we can see these buildings load pretty quickly for the whole state. And let's zoom in to Chicago. The other enhancement I have provided with these files is the ability to filter them by the geo ID, which is like the FIPS code, and the name. So the name is the county name, and you can't do this with the original data set. So I added in FIPS codes and county names. So if I double click on name, then equals, and then all, we'll get a list of all the counties in Illinois. And let's choose Cook County and click OK. And that'll get us pretty much the city of Chicago. So if you're looking for building footprint data in a good format that you can easily filter, just check out the resources page on my website and the link for that is in the description.